reporting on how the school has changed since 1874. So let's head over to the school archive. <laughs> school's archives. This is a history book from 1960 and this is a year seven book from 2018. We will now compare them. These two books are very different in the layout on what is written inside. We can see how our writing has transformed over the years and we can also see that we have learned about very different topics. We're now heading over to Mrs Patterson's office. I'm fine, thank you girls. It's really nice to see you. So do you mind us asking some questions about the school? Not at all. Far away. How do you think you have personally changed the school through through your years at Queen? When I arrived, I thought that this was an absolutely fabulous school. We've we've made a number of changes within our senior management team. We've changed a number of things around the campus. We've kind of spruced a few things up. We've made lots of changes to IT, put a lot of emphasis on careers and preparing girls, particularly in the sixth form, for careers. And we have a new uniform, did I say that? What else have we done? We've, we've been very busy. <laughs> There's recently been some changes to Croydon High, like this sports hut. So let's go have a look at some more. There have been a lot of new changes to our sports hall too. Throughout your time here, have yeah. you seen any really positive or negative changes? Well, I think most of the changes have been positive. The moment the school is in a really, a really strong position. Have you enjoyed your time? Yeah, I have. I'll yeah. ask you a few questions about the school. Please stand up if you agree and stay seated if you disagree. Firstly, do you like the new changes happening to the school? The new uniform? The new lunches? and the changes to the P block. These pictures are of all the headmistresses that run the school. We like to call it the Wall of Fame. This picture in the top corner is of Dorinda Nenneker. She was our founder of the school, which started in 1874. Hello, we are going to ask you a few questions. What changes have you seen throughout the school? Um, I think that um, from being from year 7 to year 10, there's been a lot of changes, especially with like um, new staff coming and going, and like the, general, the actual school. So like, there's been new toilets, there's been the pavilion and stuff. It was really interesting because um, on an open morning, I took around some alumni from, I think they left the school in the 60s, and they still recognise the um, lecture theatre seats, which is kind of nice. Hello, this is Lyle. The school was celebrating 140 years. So I spent a lot of time with Mrs. Sharples um, and uh, Mrs. Lorna down in the archive, looking back through the history of the school. Um, and we wrote a play, basically, about how the school had transformed from 1874 to 2014. Thank you for watching our BBC School Report on the transformation of Croydon High. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>